Sweaty in here. Meet Mike. Yes. What are we doing, Mike? The only reason I'm going to this place. Well, we don't. <laughs> they don't know where we're going. Ah, they don't know. Yes. Yeah, we're we just are going to Slan Cipriac. It's called in Bulgarian. And what is that called uh, in English? In English, it's the sand beach. Now I haven't been there. Never. I have never been there, and I'm not sure what kind of beach is this. And I'm going to investigate. <laughs> That's the basic reason I personally will go there. Also, oh, now you're the investigative journalist. Yes. What, what's my role going to be on this trip? I don't know exactly. This is something you must clarify. I think something you should have in your mind. So tell the people why. It's so for. I need to be a little clear, more clear about my intent, my purpose. Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, I think I need to have some fun. I think I need to let loose a little bit. Too much seriousness. All year long. All year long. Yeah, too much investigating, too much journalism. Yes, it's time for some fun and some bitches. <laughs> At Sunny Beach. Alright, there we go. Peace. That's our mission. Welcome to the center of Sunny Beach.
It is Friday afternoon here in Sunny Beach. I'm sitting on the balcony of my hotel room, or rather my apartment, here at the Planeta Hotel in Sunny Beach, which is a surprisingly nice complex. You can take a look at the... A little bit of the pool. I'm sure you can get a shot from here. I'm overlooking the pool here at is what is listed as either a five star or four star hotel. I've seen both. They're five stars on the outside. Anyway, I'm just renting an Airbnb apartment out of here and there are a lot of apartments that are privately owned that are actually inside hotels in Sunny Beach. It's one of the interesting little nuances of this rather bizarre yet extremely popular resort here on the Bulgarian Black Sea coast. Well, I'll fill you in a little bit on what's been going on for the past four days or so, as uh, Mike is inside sleeping at the moment. Um, <clears throat> so we've been spending some time at the beach, going out at night, working on our computers, or at least trying to. This whole week has been a little bit of a rush for me. I've got had a fair amount of work to do and it's been a huge struggle to find halfway decent Wi-Fi both here at the hotel and elsewhere in Sunny Beach, which is not really a, a workation destination. I like to use the word, term workation. I'm not really on vacation being that I have work to do during the day and on a daily basis, but yeah, it is in a sense a beach vacation also. Well, so we've been going out, trying to meet the ladies, not having a whole lot of success in doing so thus far. Neither Mike nor I has been doing particularly well with the ladies here in Sunny Beach, which, well, we've got a couple days left, but also it's Sunny Beach and we don't exactly fit in. We're not really the bar crawl or pub crawl type of guys, at least not anymore, but we're enjoying things nonetheless, and I'm going to go for a dip in the pool right here really quickly, then I'm going to hit the beach and... They will remember me 10 years from now, so that's my mission. A man on a mission. My mission is not to have some results or have some get some get with Sophia or whatever. My mission here is to just keep my word and do what I set myself to do, no matter what my emotion says to do so. So that's the thing I'm going to do for today, until the night. And that's it. Last day here, we are going to cross it for 2-3 hours, and that's it. <laughs> and the third was a big laughter, so maybe the bad things are good and the good are bad. Who the fuck knows? To me, there's something special about this place. Despite all the tomfoolery, despite all the laughing gas, you've seen some of these people walking around with the balloons and <laughs> that's laughing gas, it's, it's all over the place. Anyway, the, despite all the drunkenness, there's something special here, at least for me. 
it's this place where all these people from all over Europe as well as Russia and the Russian world and beyond actually gather and to me it's like a I say it jokingly that it's a model European Union here in Sunny Beach there's a little flavor from all these different cultures mixed in in this quirky resort in Bulgaria where I get to hear all these different languages practice some languages a few of them actually that I'm at least trying to speak I get to practice them here and meet all these different people and I don't really fit in but I still love it here it's like a, it's a little slice of Black Sea paradise for me despite all the weirdness it's Sunday morning, I'm heading to the bus station. Sunny Beach 2017 has come to a close for me. I'm now gonna head south down the Bulgarian Black Sea coast and hit up a, what is supposed to be a nice old town and some popular beaches in that area. So goodbye from Slunch of Braya, goodbye from Sunny Beach. I'm <laughs> sorry.